Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So, I've been gone for a while and I've been gone mainly because I had an ex that didn't approve of me doing YouTube videos and all that type of stuff, so I'm back. Anyway, we're just going to get into the nitty gritty of it. We're going to discuss political uh, role, uh, role play and race play. So they're completely opposite things, but they have a lot in common. And we're just going to talk about that. So race play basically is you're playing with uh, people's race as far as uh, sexual uh, desires and kind of how you deal with in the bedroom. And political play is a little different. So political play, basically, you know, you have conservatism and prog uh, prog uh, progressives, and basically you play off that. So they have a little bit of common ground. A lot of people feel that conservatives are a little bit, well, on a racist side, and they kind of play with that idea. And I got this idea to do this video because I was in the Twitterverse. So Twitterverse and Discordverse, they, they have similar topics and they have um, a lot of kink involved in them. So basically this is what this tweet said. A lot of new race player accounts that I'm coming across on here are starting to feel just straight up white supremacy real racist account. I'm definitely not here for it. Just because I like white dick doesn't mean I'm down for Trump, American conservatism, etc. Like I said, there's a difference. Anyway, so I came across this article. I think it's called Inside a Hook. I'll link it below. But basically, they were saying that 51% of conservatives are more aggressive and uh, they're more likely to kind of have darker kinks. So I've definitely had a different dynamic. It's, I guess it's a little bit different uh, and kind of the same as far as my experience. I basically, well, do the same thing. So instead of them calling me Epithets, uh, you know, nig or whatever. They uh, they call me a worthless liberal and uh, suck my conservative cock or something of that nature. And I mean, they're both enjoyable. They're just different, I guess, different flavors or uh, stuff like that. So today. As of this recording, I did have somebody that was into race and political play. So, as I said, they're two different things. Um, so, uh, we hugged because uh, it's been a long time since I've seen him since. Uh, haven't seen him since I was with my ex. And now that um, that's over, we went ahead and uh, met up with each other. So, this is how it plays out uh, for me. So, he comes in, he invites me to the bedroom, and then uh, he says, uh, well, it's intertwined. <laughs> I don't want to cut uh, myself off, but the race play and the political play are intertwined in this one. So, he'll say, yeah, you're, you're a liberal MFR. And then he'll say, sucks my cock, Nick. And I'll just begin to get down on my knees, go ahead and suck his cock. And then um, I have him deep down my throat. And he's, he tells me, suck it better. You know you like this white cock. I instantly get hard and he tells me 
okay, uh, let me go on the bed. You can suck me while I'm on the bed. So I go ahead and I suck him. I can feel his his cock throbbing and then he goes ahead and he puts his hand on my back and forces uh, himself down my throat. Uh, I can feel him just uh, quivering and I can almost feel him like he's ready to pop. So then I do something and I, I like swish my tongue around and he's, he's telling me, oh, stop, 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 stop. But I, uh, I said, can I uh, keep going, Master? He said, yes. And then he says, oh, you liberals are all, all the same. You liberal uh, nicks. And I go ahead, um, put him deep in uh, my mouth swirl my tongue a little bit while I'm sucking it and then he blows his load so that was the hot thing that I did today and I have more stories and everything just uh, go ahead remember to subscribe and like the video and if you want to hear more then come back and see me alright bye <laughs>